case briefs and so much more LS data's got what you're looking for in 1972 the Supreme Court of the United States heard the case Brooks v. Tennessee which dealt with the issue of whether a defendant can be forced to testify first in a trial the case was brought by a petitioner who had been convicted of armed robbery and unlawful possession of a pistol during the trial, the defense had requested a delay in the petitioner's testimony until after other defense witnesses had testified. But this request was denied based on a state statute. The petitioner appealed the decision, arguing that the statute violated their constitutional rights. The Supreme Court agreed, ruling that requiring a defendant to testify first infringes on their freedom of choice and right against self-incrimination. The court found that Tennessee's statute regulating the order of proof in criminal trials was unconstitutional under the Fifth Amendment, as it violated the defendant's right to remain silent and due process. While there is value in allowing diverse methods and procedures among states, the court held that the restrictions on a defendant's right to choose when to testify went too far. Consequently, the lower court's decision was upheld, and Tennessee's rule limiting a defendant's choice to testify was declared unconstitutional. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSD.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.